We stand an army of urban soldiers waiting for the train. Our feet teeter onto the restricted yellow paint, contorting our bodies into cranes to look past the backs of human beings in search of this speeding metal thing. When it reaches the station, we'll step inside and it will take us to our destination. But we hardly wait with patience. You should see the frustration on our faces. How dare it not have arrived at this place yet? We won't sit complacent. We demand cooperation from the MTA agent with pure depression on her face, who just so happens to be powerless in her current situation. What we don't see is the tragedy at play, as the love of each of our lives is standing just an arm's length away. We won't notice today. We see our soulmate as in the way of the beam of light we hope will display, indicating our train is not six, but five seconds away. If we would only turn and face each other, we might catch eyes, and to our surprise, the anguish of waiting might subside. We might not be so terrified of being late to work this time. Our jobs that make us sigh and cry, we might stop and reanalyze. We might, I hope, even decide that we could make better use of our time. We could enjoy this mariachi band. Come take my hand and let's pretend these fluorescents are the moon and this grimy subway floor the sand. Let's just dance. Before we stand clear of closing doors, let's take a second, break the norm, let's fall into each other's arms and dance across the whole platform. Let's lose ourselves as we move ourselves in tango, salsa, blues, our shells come off, reveal two humans soothed by having stepped into the groove of subway love. So when that train finally does come, we'll get on, my dear, as one, and having so much fucking fun, we won't stop dancing till we're done, until our feet are red as plums, and we've laughed so hard our cheeks are numb, and having felt the energy radiating off of you and me, our fellow passengers will be ready and psyched to heartfully join the choreography. The whole train car will bounce with glee, we'll miss our stops physically, but won't miss them if you know what I mean. And then we'll finally take our seats in Brighton Beach, Jamaica, Queens, the Rockaways, or wherever the hell we may be. And you'll rest your tired little head on me. And our smiles, they'll beam as we look back on how eagerly we awaited this train to take us away from exactly where we were supposed to be.